Holy Ghost, fire all over your body. In the mighty name of Jesus. Come out of it. You would do a miracle. A miracle today. My people, in this video, Mama Evelyn Joshua went to uh, Ghana to pray for the sick. With some of uh, Senior Prophet TB Joshua's uh, evangelist, including her own uh, biological daughter. So in this video, you're going to be seeing a few of the um, evangelists ministering uh, anointing water to the sick people. As Mama Evelyn Joshua said, Senior Prophet TB Joshua gave them uh, the anointing water to minister to the life of any sick person for healing especially the life of those who are in bondage for break through. My people, this deliverance uh, service happened many years ago. Uh, Prophet T.B. Joshua wasn't present uh, during this anointing water service. It was Mama Evelyn Joshua and some of, um, some of the evangelists from Synagogue Church of All Nations. So this happened in Accra, Ghana, you know, just to say that God is the God and what God cannot do does not exist at all. My people believe in God, trust God in any situation you find yourself. Do not lose hope. Hang on there. The same way God is, you know, healing all these people, God will heal you at the appointed time. God is really using Mama Evelyn Joshua and her disciples, and also the disciples of uh, Senior Prophet T.B. Joshua. My people, Mama Evelyn Joshua is filled with the power of the Holy Ghost. Pastor Evelyn Joshua is the leader of Synagogue Church of All Nations, which is located in uh, Lagos, uh, Nigeria. Synagogue Church of All Nations is not, you know, it's not hidden. You know, it's in Nigeria. It's in Lagos, Nigeria. So if you want to go to Synagogue Church of All Nations, you know, it's in Lagos, Nigeria. Any problems you have found yourself in, look unto God. God is the author and the finisher of our faith. God, God is not deaf, my people. God will answer you. God will. It might take a long time. It might linger at the right time. God will definitely see you through. So do not panic at all. You know, continue to serve God in truth and in spirit, my people. Serve God in truth and in spirit. That's the most important thing. You know, acknowledge God as your Lord and personal Savior. And every other thing shall be given unto you. You know, see Mama Evelyn Joshua today, what she's doing today, some people didn't believe that she can do it. From this uh, old video, it kind of telling us that Mama Evelyn Joshua has the power. Mama Evelyn Joshua is spiritually gifted. I think this video was like 11 or 10 years ago. I'm not too sure, but it's a very, you know, old video. You know, people didn't believe that Mama Evelyn Joshua can even lay hands on a sick person and the person will get healed. Just because, you know, um, Prophet T.B. Joshua died, they feel the church is going to crumble, you know, because, you know, the, the, the anointing is not there again. You know, this kind of, you know, videos is just to tell us that this woman, this woman, Sabi, what did they do? He just calmed down. The woman just calmed down. Not be say she no no say she fit do her. She just calmed down. She just they under her uh, uh, under her husband just mellowed down. Look at what God is using Mama Evelyn Joshua to do. You never believe her. You see, you never believe her. Hey, you never believe her. You go believe her by force. You go believe her, say Mama Evelyn Joshua get power. 
if you never believe him, you get believe him by force. Eh? That's why I go to hit this video every time. They hit him, they hit him, they hit him. If you don't know, say, Mama Evelyn get power, you go believe him by force. Now, God give him to Mama Evelyn Joshua. God gave it to Mama Evelyn Joshua. God, if, if that is what she merited, because she kept herself pure. You know, that's what you, that's one of the advantages of it. When you keep yourself pure, God will use you. When you keep yourself holy, God will use you. My brothers and my sisters, keep yourself holy and God will definitely use you as he is using Mama Evelyn Joshua and her disciples. God is everywhere. God is in every household. If you open your door for him, he will come in. He's just at your door knocking. He's not far away from you. It's only your sin that deter you from, from coming closer to God. It's only your sin that keeps you far away from God. When you obey God, when you do the will of God, when you do what God asks you to do, and push yourself far, far away from sin. When you pray, God will answer you. My people, God does answer prayer. God does answer prayer. God is doing all these signs and wonders today through Mama Evelyn Joshua because she's obedient to God. I'm not saying that she's holy way, Joe, you know, because sometimes even the way you look at people is also a sin. If the way you speak sometimes could also be a sin. Our Lord is so merciful. Our God is a merciful Father. He loves us. He loves us, my people. Mama Evelyn Joshua has truly revealed her agenda in scorn. Her agenda is to make scorn prosper, to make the children of God receive their healing to make the children of God, to know God more deeper and deeper. And she wouldn't have done this if not the spirit of God in her. It's the spirit of God that is helping her to achieve all this. My people, you guys should continue to put Mama Evelyn Joshua in your prayers as you have been doing. Because the previous uh, videos I made a lot of people are praying for Mama Evelyn Joshua and God will definitely hear our prayers. God will hear our prayers. My people, thank you very much for watching this particular video. And also the previous ones, I don't go lie, yo. I am so, so happy. I'm so grateful. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, my people. Thank you. Because this journey, I don't want to go it alone. I'm very, very glad that I've got you guys. I've got you guys, my people. Thank you very much for watching my videos. God bless you. My people, I say God will bless your going out. God will bless your coming in. God will bless you December month. Accident will never see any of your household members. May God continue to bless you all. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Tara, bye-bye.